Hello everyone and welcome back to another Universe Sandbox video and today we're going to be doing another object competition video but before we get into today's competition guys like always we must go over the results of the previous competition so looking at the results it looks like Siren took this one by storm making him a seven time competition winner now that's getting a that's getting pretty crazy but yeah massive congratulations to him just looking at the votes he took this one with eight votes um second place was uh free electronica they had five and then a uh, third place was pluto neon with four votes so yeah congrats to those top three and yeah siren's object was this um one here the crazy asteroid object with the atmosphere that thing was yeah very very crazy indeed but yeah it did look really cool so yeah there we are guys but yeah now congrats again to siren and yeah let's move on to today's competition Okay, everyone. So, for today's competition, we are going to be doing a proto-Venus competition, or an early Venus. So, Venus a long time ago, basically. And, yeah, this one this one should be pretty interesting. And, um, yeah, just starting off, I actually have an object for this myself. Obviously, you can't vote for this. But, yeah, this is one I made in uh, making the early Solar System video a while back. So... Yeah, that was my sort of uh, concept for it. So it was a uh, normal Venus texture. I, t I changed the colour of it to look, make it look a little more friendly looking. Gave it a light, pale, sort of bluish atmosphere. And yeah, a few patches of uh, water on it to boot as well. So yeah, that was my interpretation of it. But yeah, that, I would, if I could make it again, I definitely would change it. Um, but yeah, there we are. So there's my one. Let's see what you guys have now prepared for us if we search up competition. I'm interested to see what we've got here. Oh, hello. Okay. Right, so first up, we have Siren's one. So let's go ahead and place his one in here. Okay, so there is his Proto Venus. And what I'll do is I'll place um, I'll place them all in at once. So next up we have got J248's Proto Venus. So there is their one. Then we have uh, Proto Venus from the user 7000 Dreef. I think they're, they're new. I haven't seen them before. So welcome to the competition. So there's their Venus. Uh, next up we have got Proto Venus by King47. Let's place their one there. A little smaller. Oh, it's got a lot of craters. Uh, then we have Chen Sitch's one. Put it there. Then we had Exard Neptunians. We had a lot, a lot of them in here today. Uh, trains is ones. So let's place his one there. And then lastly, we have... If it would let me... Can I, who, who's is this one? Um, Hacker Man, that's it. Okay, cool. He said to turn off the atmosphere for his one as well. Okay, cool. Right, so here we are. So this is what we have got. So now let's actually get a closer look at these guys. So this was Siren's one. So I may have to go back in the menu to check. So here's Siren. So as we can see, it's got its uh, thick atmosphere that obviously we know um about today obviously you've got a nice set of clouds going with it as well my one didn't really have many clouds on it but yeah here's sarah's one so there you go there's a good look of it so he's gone with a uh similar to mine design wise obviously it's got patches of water over the uh looks like the venus oh, that's not actually a venus texture you can see craters on it so yeah pretty cool but yeah there is his interpretation of it. he's gone with a more brownish sort of color shade compared to my sort of more rocky gray looking shade so, yeah, that's what he has uh, made for us. And, yeah, clouds. Venus has always got its foggy clouds, even in its early version. So, there you go. Very nice indeed. Okay, so next up we have got this one. So, whose was this? Uh, let's uh, have a look again. It's annoying we have to keep uh, doing this. Okay, so this is j 248s one. Okay, cool. Right, so let's see what they have got for us. So, it looks very ocean heavy, as we can see. Yeah, very, very ocean heavy, actually. So, there it is. So, Proto-Venus. And yeah, that's uh, mainly it. So very, very ocean heavy. If we want to have a look with less oceans, we can also have a look like that. So that's the sort of colours he chose for it. But yeah, there you go. So that is his Proto Venus. Okay, cool. Next up, we have got this one. So who, whose is this one? Uh, let's see here. It's hard to remember them all. Right, so this was from the user 7000 Dreef. Okay, cool. Right, so here it is. So it looks like it's using a normal Venus texture as well. I want to say, uh, yeah, I think it is. So as we, yeah, it's definitely a Venus texture. So he's using the normal Venus texture, um, just with some uh, ocean areas added as well. Um, very ocean heavy compared to um, some of the previous ones there as well. But yeah, there it is. And obviously clouds, Venus has got its clouds and an atmosphere on top of it as well with a blue variant. So there we are. That is their version of early Venus. Okay. Right, next up we have got this one here. It actually has the name of the creator in. So King47. This is what their Venus looks like. So as we can see, lots of craters, maybe from the uh, late bombardment period. So pretty cool stuff indeed. It's got a very hazy, greenish sort of shade atmosphere. I quite like that. It looks like it's actually the normal sort of atmosphere Venus actually has in the game. So he's dimmed it a bit, so it's not as thick. And I've got to say, it does work quite well. So there it is. So as we can see, lots of crater impacts. Also rocking the normal Venus texture without any colour changes, as uh, like the previous one did as well. But yeah, a lot of uh, crater smashes on it as well there. So yeah, pretty cool looking. 
So there's their one. Next up, we have got this one. So there's a name, say, oh, this is Chen Sitch's one, okay? So we can see it's got some stormy clouds on it as well. If we have a little look underneath, that's what you get there. So looking cool. So he's gone with a sort of more swamp, almost like a swamp-like looking version of Venus, which is quite cool. Obviously, got the water on it as well. Rocking the uh, texture it has currently, the same old Venus texture there. So looking good. So yeah, there is a Chen Sitch's one. Very nice indeed. Uh, next up, we have got this one here. Ooh. Uh, so this is Exiled Neptunians one, and we can see very, very Earth-like indeed. Definitely the most Earth-like looking of them all. So here it is here. So he's using normal Venus texture. He's tinted it in a green colour, so he's gone with the interpretation of maybe Venus did have sort of life on it. But if you look at that, I mean, you'd think it looked like Earth from a distance. So yeah, he's made a very, very Earth-like looking Venus there. Got some city lights on it as well. Very cool. So yeah, there is Exiled Neptunians. Next up, we have got this one here. So it looks like another normal Venus texture. Um, let's see. So this is from the user trains. Yeah, see a normal Venus texture there. Ocean heavy. Quite similar to the ones we had further back down the line there. Different atmosphere properties and clouds though. So there is that one. And then lastly, we've got this one here. Also a very Earth-like looking world. Okay, so this was um, from the user. I think this was from the user Hacker Man, wasn't it? Let's have a little look. Um, just to double check. So this was... Yeah, Hacker Man. Okay, so he said to turn the atmosphere off. So I think it's already switched off actually. Okay, so he wants it to look like that. Okay, nice. So he's gone very cloud heavy as well. And if we look underneath, very, very greenish appearance indeed there. So what do you guys think of that? So yeah, very, very earth-like indeed. I've um, got also some uh, white polar cap areas as well. Got its water looking very nice indeed there. So yeah, there is there one. Also, no atmosphere off. So a yeah, very nice lineup of early Venuses indeed. So yeah, looking good. So let's quickly run through them all before we uh, finish off again today. So at the start of the list, obviously, we have my one, so you can't obviously vote for that one. But if we look at the competition object, so the first subject here, this one was Sirens, right here. So that was Sirens one. Then we had J248, which was um, this one here. So there's that one. Then we had this one here from the user 7000 Reef, right here. Next up was King 47s, which is the one with the lots of craters on it. Then moving on, we had Chen Sitch's one here with the clouds on it. Then we had the first of the Earth-like looking ones, which was Exiled Neptunian's one there. Then after that, we had Trains' one. And then lastly, we had Hackerman's one there at the very end. So yeah, there we go. There's a full lineup of all the Venuses, guys. So yeah, let me know what you think down below um, in the comments of this. And also, if you'd like to take part in the voting for this competition, make sure to join my Discord server. Link in the description where you can uh, upload your own objects to these competitions. And also, vote for them as well. And yeah, if that all said and done, guys, a massive thank you for watching today's video. And if you enjoyed it, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe for more, help us on the journey to 30,000 subscribers. And yeah, make sure you guys all have a great day. Stay safe out there, and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.